Hey there everyone, welcome to the Imperial Outpost. Thanks for stopping by, I do appreciate it. Now later on this year, we are going to be getting another Star Wars series and this one is called The Skeleton Crew. Now officially there's no date as of yet to when it will be aired. Now I believe it, it will be not long after we receive the acolyte and just incidentally if you want to check out my talk on the acolyte then uh, i'll leave a link up there at, at, at the end of this video so as i say there, there's no official uh, trailer for the skeleton crew from disney but i'm just going to play you a clip of a trailer that um has been put together by um someone okay so uh, let me show you that now in this galaxy there are only two kinds of people those who obey me and those who regret ever crossing my path i will show them power i will show them strength and dignity you are here to die meaningless to resist against me. That's my final warning. They are not just children. They are the symbol of the hope. You have to be their guide. You won't get away this time. I'm going to kill you. Okay, so as you saw there, the clip from the skeleton crew made by somebody who's not officially working for Disney. It's a, it's a fan-made um, trailer. Now, I noticed in that trailer, there was a clip from The Mandalorian. Why would there be a clip from The Mandalorian in the actual trailer? Uh, that, that, that's silly. Um, and... There was other clips from the Aliens franchise. Now, that's just bizarre. Why the hell would you have a clip from the Alien franchise in a Star Wars um, series trailer? So, there you go. Take that with a pinch of salt, if you like. Looks good. Looks brilliant. Think, wow, yeah, brilliant. But it's it's unofficial. It, it, it's not, not a real trailer. Uh, well, not for the skeleton crew anyway. So now we've got that out of the way, let me um, explain a little bit of uh, a little bit more about what I know of the skeleton crew and basically what it's about. So this actually series, this actual series was created. Um, oh, it was co-created by two guys from the Spider-Man films. Um, they are Christopher Ford and John Watts. Now, um, they're, they're both good good directors, and I believe um, John Watts will be directing a few series in, in this... Um, uh, so, sorry, not a few series, a few episodes in, in this series. Uh, mind you, it, it will be... Um, the The series will be over eight episodes, by the way. And they are in conjunction or, or basically uh, the, the, these two guys that have co-created co uh, this this series for Disney are working alongside two great guys that, that are really Star Wars fans, you know, that they really know their stuff. And one other person who's not not really a star wars person so we have john farrow and dave filoni who are the executive producers for this along with the president of disney kathleen kennedy and i'm hoping that kathleen kennedy although she has the final say but i'm hoping she leaves it up to the you know, these these four four guys are directors and, and the other two producers 
because they will come out with you know if she, if she leaves them alone they will come out with with a a, a really good 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 series now the series is about a group of kids that make a mysterious discovery on their home planet and in doing so i believe they managed to steal a ship and shoot off into the galaxy for a bit of an adventure obviously it's something to do with this mysterious discovery and in doing so they get lost god please no 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 uh, obviously they don't know how to work the ship properly you know um but anyway they, they get lost in the in the galaxy and during their um way in you know their their journey through the galaxy to try and get home they come across uh, a character played by jude law who's um a mysterious jedi and um he helps them to get home whether he tries to um uh, teach them the ways of the jedi if if any of them um have have uh, showing signs of of having um the um jedi ways etc and he's also aided by um another character who at the moment um are, are, the character's undisclosed or I, I can't find anywhere what you know the the name of the of, of this character but uh, it's played by an actress by the name of uh, Kerry Condon, which um, uh, she she's from the uh, Banshee of uh, Ishelin. Um, I'm not sure. I haven't seen it, so I'm not sure whether that's a film or, or a series. Um, but but, but uh, that, that that's where she's from. And between these two, they um, apparently help help the the kids uh, find their way back home now the uh, the series is uh broadcast over eight episodes and uh, i'm hoping that maybe at the eighth on the eighth episode they don't find their way back home because then you can carry on the story with with a second series um that of course you know um that 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 being said rather uh, is provided um the series is good and people are going to watch it and one of the kids is going to be an autolon or i believe is going to be an autolon now an autolon if you remember is if you went to tantooine and you popped into the cantina in the corner of the cantina you would see a band and the autolon in the band is the guy with the long snout playing the piano type instrument and he's blue so that's that would be interesting if if that is true um well we've yet to see let's let, let's see when 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 it's out but basically yeah that's that's the gist of of the story now in the timeline of star wars it's going to be around the mandalorian the book of boba fett and ashoka era okay in the timeline that being said we may be lucky and we may get some cameos from either din Djarin, the mandalorian or boba fett or even ashoka because obviously we've got a mysterious Jedi, so that's a possibility he could meet up with a Soka a Shok along the way. Who knows? That's that's yet uh, for us to find out. That's that's all I've got for you guys. Um, like I say, not sure when it's going to be out. It will be sometime later on this year. So hopefully Disney will be putting out an official trailer very very soon. And until then, we shall just have to keep an eye on Disney. Anyway, thanks very much for joining me. Please 
don't forget to like and subscribe and if you want to leave me any comments please feel free to do so until the next video long live the empire